Hey everyone, welcome back to Auto Repair. If your check engine light is on and you've scanned your car only to find code P0107, don't worry, we're breaking it down today. What it means, what causes it, and how you can fix it yourself. Let's get into it. P0107 stands for Manifold Absolute Pressure Sensor Circuit Low Input. In plain English, your car's computer is saying the map sensor is reporting a voltage that's too low usually under zero to five volts. The map sensor measures air pressure in your intake manifold. This info helps the engine control module or ECM calculate air density and adjust fuel delivery. When it reads too low, your engine doesn't run right. Common causes of P0107. Number one, faulty map sensor. The sensor may be malfunctioning internally and sending incorrect voltage signals. Test the map sensor with a multimeter. If it's out of spec, replace it. Number two, damaged or corroded wiring. Wires or connectors may be frayed, broken or corroded, interrupting the signal. Inspect the wiring harness from the sensor to the SEM. Repair or replace any damaged wires. Number three, loose or disconnected sensor plug. A connector might be unplugged or loose, preventing signal communication. Securely reconnect or replace the connector. Use dielectric grease to prevent corrosion. Number four, vacuum leaks. A vacuum leak in the intake system can cause incorrect pressure readings. Check hoses and gaskets for cracks or disconnections. Replace damaged vacuum signal. Number five, bad ECM rare, but the ECM might be failing to process the map signal. Only after ruling out all other possibilities should the ECM be tested and replaced by a professional. Number six, short to ground in signal wire. The signal wire could be shorted to ground, forcing voltage lower than expected. Trace the wiring diagram, identify the short, and repair the wiring. Fixing a P0107 can be straightforward with the CE. Write tools and steps. If you re dyeing this repair, focus on testing voltages and grounds properly, inspecting and cleaning all connections, using quality replacement parts clearing the code after repair and test driving. Car Repair Pro Tips Use an OBD2 scanner to read trouble codes before swapping parts. Many issues aren't what they seem. Check forums or YouTube for people with your exact model. Symptoms often point to common fixes. When taking things apart, label wires, bolts, and parts using tape or bags. This avoids the where did this go? Moment don't over tighten bolts especially spark plugs, lug nuts, or anything aluminum. Use a torque wrench and look up specs. Disconnect the battery, especially for electrical work. This avoids blown fuses or fried modules. Thanks for watching.